Hello everyone and welcome back to 99 episode 3. So we have already split off from the last branch and reached out directly to Ruka Senpai. And so now we're meeting up with her in the courtyard. Yay. After school, I wait for Senpai in the courtyard. Very soon I'm going to be meeting Commander and Ghost. Oh yeah, that's right. On the surface... Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. <laughs> On the surface, it's gonna look like I'm double-crossing Kujo and everyone else belonging to... Uh, what did Yuki call our group again? The Valhalla Society? Anyway, I'll be basically betraying everyone. Meaning I won't be able to go to our regular meetings at Nineball. I've gotta make it look like I'm keeping my distance from my comrades, or I won't be able to sell my story. When we met him, Commander was wearing our school's uniform. For all I know, he could be watching me from somewhere right now. Stares off into the distance. Nope, that's a bird. Hence why it's better if I wait for Senpai alone, without any of my friends nearby. It'll make me look more trustworthy. I hope. Of course, I don't even know if Commander's watching me, so this is really more for my peace of mind than anything. Also, while Kujo and Sora did agree to stay away, they didn't look happy about it. Still, you can never be too paranoid, I think. Better take every precaution. Uh, uh, no. oh, oh, uh, sorry. Senpai came from the direction opposite the one I was looking in, so I didn't notice her until she's standing right next to me. Wow, this is the fastest sentence you've ever said to our face. <laughs> Just saying. No, it's fine. Oh, uh, feel, feel free to take a seat. Eh? Uh, oh, yeah, you, you said you weren't comfortable around guys. Uh, here, I'll, I'll scoot over to the edge. Is one cheek enough, or is that too much, or what are we talking about? Usa. Serenity now! She puts a hand on her chest and takes a few deep breaths. After hesitating for a bit, she finally gathers her resolve and sits down next to me. Ooh, this is new. I like it. Um, if anything, I should be the one to apologize. Are, are you sure you're okay? I'm, I'm not being scary or anything, right? I see. Uh, glad to hear it. I'm not sure anyone's ever called me kind and understanding before. It's kind of embarrassing. Fidgeting awkwardly, I clear my throat and try to get the discussion back on topic. <clears throat> oh, so, uh, you, you talked to the other two in Rig Veda already? Yes. I was worried, Receptive to me joining their group? Yes. I'm a little concerned about that, although I could see Commander just being like, ha ha, I knew he'd come around. It's a 50-50 that it's either a trap or he's just like, yeah. You know, I really don't know with Commander's personality. And I think Ghost is just like, yeah, whatever. Where's the meeting place? Who's Takamine-kun? Renia Takamine. Did you know him before all the stuff with artifacts and superpowers started happening? あの、
クラスメイトとは知らなくて So he was just an inter internet friend. Then you met him in real life after you found your artifact and discovered he was actually your classmate? So, so this is. Hi. That's one hell of a coincidence. What are the odds? Just like, what are the odds of all of these things happening in the same town? Hmm. At least there's a plot reason for all of it happening in the same town. True, yes. Though I guess it's just like how I've been meeting fellow users in quick succession, too. First Kujo, then Sora, then Yuki. We knew Sora, that's not new. <laughs> I'm imagining him with like the little finger puppets from SpongeBob. <laughs> Gang's all here. I wonder if users, or maybe the artifacts they hold, are drawn to each other. Huh? Oh, oh, my bad. I, I didn't mean to go quiet like that. We're just staring down at our hand with our little finger puppets. She probably thought it was her fault that I fell silent. I'll save any more brooding for when I'm back home. For now, I need to steel myself to meet Commander and Ghost. All right, let's go then. Lead the way, Senpai. Hi. Uh, あの、あの、このまま話せるんですが。Oh, can she like control that? I don't know. I didn't think so, but it, but I'm beginning to wonder if that is a willing thing. By your other self, do you mean how you sometimes start acting like you're the head of the royal family? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there was a different way that you could have put that. She looks down, blushing slightly. I probably shouldn't have phrased it like that to her face, huh? Ah, uh, sorry for the bad analogy. Th that's it, a noble lady. That would have been a much better way of putting it. We are not amused. Oh, okay. Ah. So, leaving aside the fact that he's got some twisted ideals, you're just not that comfortable around him? I think he's a big meanie. Yeah. I purse my lips angrily at that. I also have to keep my mouth shut or I'll end up laughing at the unintended double entendre. Forceful, huh? I get what she means. That Chuni Edge Lord's definitely intimidating. お、同じアニメが好きなその動向の詩ではあるんですけど、あの、急に手を広げたりとかびくってすることがあって。あ、ごめんなさい。悪口を言いたいわけじゃなくて、そのえっと、はい。Now you can keep bad mouthing him. We are perfectly fine with that. I kind of imagine he's just like <clears throat> Still doing my best not to laugh I watch as Senpai squirms in embarrassment Despite how timid she is She can be surprisingly blunt I bet if she just opened up a little more She'd get along with everyone But in order to make that possible I've got to get her safely out of Rig Veda all right, let's get going. As for your uh, personality shift, I'm fine with that too. Mm -hmm. We'll see if we're saying that later. Yeah. Look, I'm just asking the questions that everyone wants to know. Like, does it count as a threesome if there are two personalities? Uh, if they switch during? Why am I analyzing this? 
No worries. I know I can trust you, senpai. No need to use honorifics. You, you can just call me by my name. I, I'm younger than you, after all. Well, I suppose that's fine as long as we're not talking to Sora at the same time. Is that right? Uh, well, what, whatever works for you. Hi. Okay. Now let's actually get going for real. I'm counting on you, senpai. Hi. Good, we're counting on each other. We get to our feet and start walking to the Shrine of the White Serpent's Relic. Boy, that is a mouthful. Now then, time to put on my traitor face. I must read that as trailer face at first. And I was just thinking, he slips on a flannel, <laughs> knocks out one of his teeth, is like, all right, I'm ready to go. Well, you know, just upgrade myself to a double wide. Put on trucker hat. So, tell me, what about this rig Vader we gonna be doing, huh? What kind of rig is she? 18 wheelers? You're sitting there. What? I need to throw away my morals and act like a true scoundrel. If I can't help the others yeah. fight. <laughs> good, good. If I can't help the others fight the evil eyes user, I need to at least handle all of the dangerous jobs leading up to that confrontation. I'm determined to find proof that it's ghost. That's going to be interesting. It only takes a few minutes to reach the rendezvous point. Along the way, I go over my list of objectives one more time. First, I read that as adjectives. <laughs> first, find proof that Ghost is the Evil Eye's user. Second, find out what the Evil Eye looks like. Lastly, and most importantly, make sure that those two don't find out that Kosaka Senpai is working with me. What does the evil eye look like? <laughs> I'm the one who roped her into this mess. I absolutely cannot do anything that'll put her in danger. I need to make sure that if things go south, I'm the only one taking the fall. Oh, good. She already switched. Uh... <laughs> Once that top button goes off, all bets are off. Senpai's already switched to her other personality, and she's being quite... forward. It's kinda awkward. I did say she could call me whatever she wanted, but... Kakeru-sama is a bit much. Though, I can't say I dislike it. Kakeru-sama? No. Yeah, I'm ready. I brace myself and walk toward the shrine entrance. I already messaged Kujo and Sora to let them know the meeting's about to start. They both told me to be careful, but that's all. Of course, I have every intention of proceeding with caution. I may have decided to trust Senpai, but that doesn't mean I should be letting my guard down. I need to think how to adjust my course of action if they see through my plan. If I fuck up, they might kill me. Which is why I've been doing everything, well, most things in my power to raise the odds of success. Now it all comes down to how well I can act. Showtime. Big smile. Let's do this. Leroy! Sorry, what? Yeah. Senpai stops right in front of the entrance to the shrine. Just at the start, right? Gotcha. Okay. Easy enough. Huh? You want me to stay quiet the whole time? Hi. Watakushini ayatsurarete iru. Do you set a nano de show? かけるさまが率先して発言してしまったら簡単に見破られてしまいますわ。Oh, so 
うまくやってみせますわですがもし露見してしまった時はお願いいたしますわね。ああ、well, I'm gonna GTFO。What will you do? Well, let's hope that doesn't happen <笑>。私としては、そちらの方が好ましい展開なのですが。では、行きましょう。can can we not。先輩 strides into the shrine。and I follow a little ways behind her。trying my best to look like one of her enraptured followers。This version of Senpai is so bold, it's kind of reassuring. For now, I'll let her do all the talking. I'm happy to do so if it makes it more believable that I'm being controlled. Kitaka. <laughs> Just noshing on her gum. The two of them are standing in a rather secluded corner of the shrine grounds. Commander. Renya Takamine looks confident, and Ghost is chewing gum with an annoyed expression on her face. Ghost spits her gum onto the ground and gives me a withering glare. I do as Senpai told me and just stand there silently. I try my best not to meet Ghost's gaze and look as absent minded as possible. Unfortunately, I can't help but watch Takamine as he takes a tissue out of his pocket and scoops up the wad of gum from the ground. For someone who likes playing the villain, he's surprisingly upright. So it's a Nakama ni narita itte? Skoshi chigai masu wa ne? Nakama ni narita ino de wa naku. Alright, that was a long winded way of saying that. I'm sorry, I thought you were done talking. Senpai scoots closer to me and hugs my arm. She flashes Commander and Ghost a playful grin. Uh, hello. I can feel her boobs pressing against me. Man, this is not the time to be thinking about this kind of crap. I need to focus, but my stupid virgin brain keeps getting distracted. Naruhodo. Kimi no kugutsu ni shita toyu koto ka. Kugutsu nante. そんな言い方しないでくださいましただ心を通い合わせただけですわ<笑>それはすまない謝罪しようとにかく私決めましたのこの方を仲間にしますわよろしくて司令官フンコマンダー puts his hands on his chin and narrows his eyes scrutinizing me It's probably not a good idea to let him see into my eyes. He might figure out we're lying. おそらく彼はバルハラソサイエティの中心となる人物よくやったエンプレスもはや敵ではないな Bold of you to assume that we are the fangs of the Valhalla society I don't think we're much of anything to the Valhalla society maybe like a shedding scale Wait, Bold of you to assume that there is a Valhalla society Nonsense there's always been a Valhalla society ever since Yuki was a little girl and came up with the concept The name came later. Empress. Sasuk Karekara. Barhara Society no Naibu Joho, Kikidash de Kuretamai. Yadesua? Nani? Kareo Rio Sutamini. Scarao Tskatawake de Varima Semono. Empress. Wagamamo, you know, Yoshitamai. Ima was sensu tunano tasso. 
我々リグベータとバルハラ・ソサイエティとの興味ありませんわそんなのおおまったく奔放なのは結構だが少々君はリグベーダのメンバーとしての自覚がおいゴースト suddenly interrupts Takamine an irritated frown on her face もう一度聞きたいんだがいい何でしょうそいつに力を使ったんだなええ嘘だなおお先輩 and I gulp She's not just suspicious. No, she's sure of her deduction. Oh no, she has her own blue boxes. She totally knows. <laughs> I am a zombie. <laughs> she just comes back over and starts leaning her boobs up against again. The creepy smile just forms and starts leaning her boobs up against again. The creepy smile just forms and starts like, oh, no, never mind. He's, he's totally a zombie. <laughs> that would be amazing. <laughs> no, that's enough.、Uh, thanks for trying, Senpai, but I'll take it from here. Oh, no, we're off to script. Kakeru sama? Senpai gives me a startled look. And ghosts scoffs at us. <laughs> We can't all fake things as well as you can. Oh, fine, fine, I'll talk. So stop glaring at me like that. I gently disentangle my arm from Senpai's grasp and raise my hands in surrender. My life is riding on how well I can convince these guys that I've changed my mind about them. Fortunately, I prepared for a scenario like this. Time for Plan B. One way or another, I need to trick these two into believing I'm on their side. Sorry, Senpai, I made you lie on account of my cowardice. <laughs> Ghost's right. Senpai didn't use her power on me. Oh? Ah, sorry, I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be a b l e 俺らを騙してただで済むと思ってんのかあ,あ Hang on, at least hear me out. 聞いてやる必要なんざまあ待てゴースト臆病と言ったなどういう意味だなぜ彼女に嘘をつかせた Exactly what I said I was ashamed 何 I said I was、uh, ashamed. Like, I don't, I don't know. I didn't want you guys to realize how impure or rather simple my motives were. Yeah, that's why I didn't want you guys to find out you know, the truth. No. Jeez. I've fallen in love with Senpai. <laughs> This is actually a pretty good plan B. It feels like time slowed to a crawl. Both Ghost, who hasn't visibly shown any emotion other than irritation this whole time, and Takamine, who's been keeping up his Chuni persona, look absolutely floored. This was probably the last thing either of them were ex was expecting. Which is why I chose this particular story. To go, with, to go with if they called out our bluffs. I don't know why that sentence split there. That was odd. Some crappy excuse would probably just make me look more suspicious. But what about the crappiest excuse possible? It's so lame they might just believe it. After all, no one would expect an excuse this dumb to be a lie. Heh, <laughs> yeah, you know? Basically, the more ridiculous and unbelievable my lie, The more likely they are to believe it. I'm not crafty enough to come up with a good alibi, but I might be able to fool them with one that's so bad it's good. I just hope this plan works. Fortunately, even if they don't completely believe me yet, their bewilderment has bought me some time. 
I just have to sell my story before they get over their shock. See? I knew you guys would react like that. That's why I didn't want to admit it. But since I've already told you, I might as well tell you everything. Honestly, I don't give a shit about Rig Veda's ideals. Actually, that's putting it lightly. I hate your ideals. I don't, I don't care about what your reasons are. Look, murder's wrong. No way I'd ever approve of the way you jerks do things. Wow, okay, we are really putting all the cards on the table for this. But if... I join you guys, I get to spend more time with Senpai, and that's all I'm after. You got a problem with it? <laughs> Boy, her other self is going to be in a really awkward position when she snaps out of this. Senpai grabs onto my arm again. Of course she knows I'm putting on an act. I feel bad about telling such a stupid lie especially since it involves her, so I got her permission to go with this plan if they found out I wasn't actually under control. Oh. Okay. I even asked her if it'd be okay to say that we're dating, if necessary. The plan had been to put on this ridiculous charade by myself, and I told Senpai all she had to do was stand back and watch. But it seems like she wants to play along to make it more believable. Uh. Man. Is this really the best thing I could come up with? Uh, I'm really sorry you have to go along with such an idiotic strategy, Senpai. I disagree. I think this is a fantastic strategy. If nothing else, the look on Ghost's face is worth it. <laughs><笑><笑> Yes, lo and behold, the audacity. Yeah, The only thing I love is killing. I don't understand other kinds of love. Ah, to be fair to Ghost, it does look like she has some concept of, like, genuine camaraderie. Yeah, you know? Like, even if she doesn't want to show it, because she does think, like, that well, that's a stupid reason to betray people, so she has some concept of loyalty and... Stuff. Okay, no, no, no. Uh, you see, I interpret that as a slightly different thing. I interpret it as her logic is, now, killing them to get their powers. That's a good reason to betray someone. <laughs> okay, that's a good point. <laughs> just from what we have seen about Ghost. I just want to spend time with the girl I love. I think that's a perfectly legit motive, personally. Hmm. <laughs> <笑>理解できるほどの経験ねえだろてめえは。OK。経験はなくても知識はある。人の歴史にその事実が刻まれているのだからな。だからわかる。わかるか。一つ聞きたい。What? What, what kind of questions that? She showed me her boobies and I liked them too. Crap, I wasn't expecting that. But I can't take too much time to think. I've got to keep talking. It was... Love, love at first sight, okay? It's not the kind of thing you can explain easily, but if I had to say... Ah, tell me. Uh... For starters, she's smoking hot. Mm. Hmm. Plus, her personality's... Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing to say this in front of her, but... <laughs> oh, she's enjoying this. Uh-oh. <laughs> so, okay. Uh, I mean, she's really kind, and when she gets all flustered, it's super cute, and it makes me want to protect her. Oh, but, but I like this side of her, too. 
What else? Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's got huge tits. All right. Hole. Uh, I mean, just, just massive melons. Huge honkers. Giant lobes. <laughs> I'm really glad I had her cut you off, actually. I feel like that was the right <laughs> choice. I don't know how lo much longer I could have gone with the alliteration. No, but I appreciate the effort. Senpai's laughing it off, but I totally fucked up there, didn't I? I suddenly break out in a cold sweat. I don't know, I thought the alliteration was pretty damn good. I know it's hard to stop yourself when you're just spouting off whatever comes to mind, but that was really rude. Hell, it was just straight up sexual harassment. And, uh... But now that I've crossed that line, I have to take it all the way. What's all the way? Oh boy. It's time to go full dumbass mode. No, never go full dumbass. <laughs> Fine, I admit it. I fell in love with Senpai's boobs. マジかよ。何言ってんだこいつ。胸と来たか。ちなみに。おい、お前も話広げようとすんな。いや。聞かせてくれ。君の仲間。九条宮子女子も。なかなかのサイズだったように見受けられた。This is going to be really awkward. 彼女ではダメなのか? If uh, Sora and Kujo are just kind of off to the side using Sora's ability to be discreet. <laughs> it's just, uh, well. True, uh, Kujo's got a huge rack too. It looks even bigger because she's so short, but you know. <laughs> Senpai's tits are even bigger. Oh my God. I'm sorry, Kujo, please don't hate me. I absolutely cannot let her ever find out I said these things. Really though, I'm super sorry. I won't ever be able to tell you why I'm sorry, but please believe that I'm being sincere. Also, I am really sorry that you have to hear me spew all this vulgar crap, senpai, but it's too late to go back now, so please don't stop me. I admit I might have had a thing for Kujo in the beginning, but that all changed after I met senpai. I realize something important about myself. We're going to make ghosts hate us for a completely different reason now. I wouldn't be with the girl who has the biggest boobs. <laughs> That's just the kind of man I am. Oh my god. For the sake of senpai's tits, <laughs> I'd gladly betray my sister <laughs> and Kujo. <laughs> wow. I have no regrets. I have all the regrets. <laughs> I'll be honest, that's probably the correct response. Mm-hmm. Wow. Like hell it was. Though I appreciate you backing me up here, senpai. Plus, by throwing away my pride, it looks like I've managed to fool these two. Uh, I'm pretty sure no one would expect a spy to sink this low just to keep their cover from being blown. <laughs> well, you know, you to might be, be fair. Right. To be fair, the dumbass defense of being like, oh no, I'm just stupid. That's a really good one. It is. You're right. Gotta give him credit. I bet you two are totally fine with me joining now, huh? Kakaru. Kakaru Nimi. Nimi Kakeru. Commander scowls angrily at me as he approaches us. Well, crap. Shit, did I mess up? <laughs> I see you two are a man of culture. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what? He grabs my left hand. Wait, hang on. Is this a handshake? <laughs> oh my god. That is amazing. I love everything about this scene. Ghost's face, Ruka's face, it's just... <laughs> I uh... love it. <laughs> oh, it got better. <laughs> Ghost looks utterly nonplussed. Honestly, 
I'm a little shocked and kind of worried myself. I mean, this is the development I was hoping for, but I figured these two would be disgusted with me after I started going off about how much I loved tits. I guess dialing the dumbass meter up to 11 actually works. I just didn't count on Takamine also being a dumbass. Yep. No, I'm sure he's just like... <laughs> yep, it's like, oh man, a culture. Oh no. Anybody who likes massive mommy milkers is my friend. <laughs> There's more alliteration that came back. Oh. Oh. Thanks. Okay, so she just completely sees through us, but she's just kind of going along with it. Oh, I see now. Commander lets go of my hand and twirls around, spreading his arms wide. What are you more of an ass man? What what's happening? おのがよくぼうをぶちまけたかれのどこを疑おうというのだ。いや、疑う余地などない。彼はもう我々のどうした。オッケー。チブサのもとに我々は一つとなるのだ。ノ、ノバイド。いや、べ。こいつ重たい
身をもってあがなうがいいおおい問答無用と言ったアカシックレコードアクセス Where are you pulling this from now? Nine? アカシックレコードだと OK, here we go <sighs> 我招く無因の勝利に慈悲はなくあまねく役を逃れる術もなしまさかこれは<laughs> Takamine looks shaken I look confused Is Yuki chanting some kind of spell? Does she have to do that to activate her powers? No. Wait, is she seriously intending to. Kakeru sama? Katemaste? Shikatari masewane. Kanojo watakshiga. Kakeru sama? Nanji. Sono fui na fui no naka de ansi kuwa yada. Toa ni hakanak. Yahari korewa. I feel like I should be intimidated, but I'm also just taken aback. It is a way worse startup time than Special Beam Cannon. <laughs> yeah, really. I can't. <laughs> Ghost shoots out something that grazes Yuki, interrupting her incantation. She then takes a few steps toward us. さあ、来いよ。さあ、やろうぜ。ユーザー同士のバトルだ。私の目的はその裏切り者の始末。今あなたたちとやいばを交える。つもりはない。ひよってんじゃねえよ。もうてめえは俺たちにも喧嘩を
Uh, okay, now what do we think the likelihood is that Cujo and Sora are going to be able to defuse this situation? I'm thinking zero. Ghost seems awfully happy about this turn of events. Did Yuki really stop time? So not only can she stop people in their tracks, she can even stop time itself? There's certainly a lot more to her power than meets the eye. But um, tch. No wonder she's so confident in her abilities. Baruhara society. Aite ni totte fusoku nashi. To itta tokoro ka. Zeyin, buji da na? Mochiron desu. Kakeru sama, hontou ni okega wa arimasen ka? Yeah, I'm fine. She didn't actually attack me, so. Masaka are hodo hantai shiteita ghost ga.彼を構うとはな。ああ、何言ってんだてめえ。彼も我々の仲間ということでいいんだな。ふなよ。知らねえよ。勝手にしろ。了承と受け取ろう。いや、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、
Senpai tugs on my arm, dragging me out of the shrine. I can't afford to relax just yet, but I've managed to make it into Rig Veda at least. Senpai's right. I should take it easy for the rest of the day and plan for the steps ahead. The real hard part's yet to come, in more ways than one. Alright, well I think we're going to call it for this episode. So we successfully infiltrated Rig Veda, and also pissed off Yuki. That's not a circumstance I was expecting to happen. But I suppose it did kind of get Ghost off of our backs, so that's something. Mm-hmm. Uh, little victories, and also we're unofficially dating Haruka, at least for appearances, but I'm sure things will just escalate from there because that seems to be how these plot lines go. I do wonder what the big mm -hmm. confrontation's going to end up being, though. Like, is it just going to be trying to keep up appearances to keep Ghost from figuring out what's going on, or is Yuki going to be a constant thorn in the side? That, I don't know. But we'll find out soon enough, I suppose. Well, that's all I've got. Do you have anything? Oh, I really enjoyed this. This was great. Oh, it was hilarious. It was a good episode. <laughs> Really funny and dramatic. Good blend. Well, thank you all so much for watching. We hope you've enjoyed this episode and we hope to see you in the next one. For now, we are the Bridge Boys, signing off. <laughs>